What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I do appreciate you being here. Today I've been going over Destiny 2 video and today guys I want to showcase to you the hidden perk, the Chalice of Opulence, opens up when you actually complete it. This video will explain the new node, what it does and also showcase some footage of it in action. But before we go any further guys, if you do enjoy the video and would like to show your support you can by hitting that like button. Okay guys, so the Chalice of Opulence, the main tool behind the Menagerie, what in many people's opinions is the best PvE addition to the game besides the raids. I actually agree with that, I think the Menagerie is amazing and the concept behind it allowing us to basically craft our own loot is incredible. The only thing I wish it did do is with every weekly reset, the weapons that weren't exclusive to it and the armors that ain't exclusive to it, but more so the weapons, I wish they rotated with every weekly reset. Even still, the Menagerie is an incredible addition. Okay, so the Chalice is what we are working towards actually completing in order to make the most out of the Menagerie and the loot it offers. To completely upgrade your Chalice of Opulence, you indeed need a shit ton of Imperials in which some nodes alone cost 6,000 upwards. But what actually happens when you complete the Chalice of Opulence and unlock every single node? Well people, a new node opens up called Perfected, and what this does is, loot sources that originally drop Imperials will now drop runes. Well if you think about it, you won't actually have any need for Imperials when you've actually completed the Chalice of Opulence, so this makes sense. So what actually drops Imperials in game at the moment which will now drop runes as a substitute? Well, Werner's weekly bounties do, the chests and the barge on Nessus do, and so do certain triumphs. Will all of these sources now give you runes instead? Well at this point in time it's a little unclear. What will happen though, and I can confirm this is, if you now have power and efficiency too, which gives you a rare chance of getting 500 Imperials, well, instead of those Imperials, which can drop from Strikes, Gambit or Crucible, you will now be rewarded one or two runes, as you can see it happening on screen now, with my pal landing what looks to be three blue runes, blue which are the rarest, and he got these for completing a standard strike. So it's quite a decent trade if you ask me. So the perfected perk or perfected node unlocks once you complete the Chalice of Opulence. And it trades all sources in which you were originally rewarded Imperials, you now get runes. So just a short but sweet video on what actually happens once you complete your chalice. Now the footage was supplied to me by my pal Dark Armed Games, whose Twitch can be found linked within the video description. Do check him out. But on that note, we have come to the end of the video, guys. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really does help out. And if you are new around here and enjoy daily Destiny 2 videos, be sure to subscribe. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.